go. I'm on. And then, yeah, and you can just introduce uh, yourself. Yeah, I'm Seb from UTS Green, and that's the sustainability unit here uh, at UTS. And today we're running uh, one of our Fix It workshops, which is part of a program of a series of six workshops over um, about a six month period where we look at um, everyday items that we all use from you know a pair of shoes through to electrical appliances um, today we're looking at digital devices um, that we um, we have all around us every day and the consumer society that we live in you know we buy them and then it encourages us to often throw them away when they get maybe a cracked screen or something like that and this workshop series is looking at how can we repair them um, whether or not they can be repaired, and sometimes um, they can't, we need to throw them away and replace them. But sometimes they're really simple things and we just actually don't have the knowledge ourselves. So it's about knowing uh, how to do it, um, how to diagnose the problem, and if we can't do it ourselves, take it. Where do, where do we take it? You know, um, Where can we get it fixed? And um, is it cost effective? In some cases it might not be, but in some cases it, you know, it's relatively cheap to get this stuff repaired. Um, and so that's what the series is about, and that's um, what today's about. Um, we're looking uh, today at digital devices, so things like laptops, iPhones, um, computers, game consoles, that sort of thing. And um, we've got a wide range of those uh, today with our uh, experts here from um, the Bauer Repair Cafe, who are uh, electricians who've come in um, with some specialised knowledge to work with people and have a look at um, people have bought their, their, their um, broken devices in, have a look and see um, whether or not they're repairable. So that's um, what we're here doing today. I might hand over to Jade who can maybe talk a little bit more about um, repair cafes and the repair culture that's growing uh, um, both here in Sydney and um, around the world.